Hi, I'm Dr. Christopher Cortman, and now for the Mental Health Minute. I was asked this week to speak to a group on bullying. And this is a group of kids from a lower socioeconomic status part of town. And I want to ask them, what is bullying? Where does bullying come from? How does it happen? Do you bully? Do you get bullied? How does this work? Well, we have a lot of research on bullying by now. And one of the things we understand is that people who are bullied often bully themselves. And we know that the bully gets hurt, according to research, and so does the one who's bullied, and so do the bystanders. Everyone who witnesses a bullying event ends up paying a price for it. So if you hang around me, you hear that behavior is purposeful. Everything we do, we get something from or we wouldn't do it. So, why do people bully? Well, it's simple. Very often we bully because we don't feel good about self. And we feel that by putting somebody else down, it helps to elevate ourselves. It makes me feel better about me by subjugating somebody else. So what do we do with that? As soon as we understand that a child has issues with that, we want to interfere, we want to intercede, because we understand that they have some deep-rooted issues that they don't feel good about self. And we want to help them to promote self in other ways. According to the great psychologist, Dr. Sid Simon, when a person likes themselves, two things are true. Number one, they don't do things to hurt themselves. And number two, they don't do things to hurt other people.